audience and uh welcome back to another video and uh in today's video we're actually going to continue on the uh dark souls series uh so in the last episode we actually killed uh the old demon king so now we're actually moving on to the um ethereal war valley we're gonna stop at the tur uh, church church bonfire we're gonna stop there and um Yesterday I kind of forgot to collect like all the undead bone shards and essence shards and all that. I'll get to that, but uh, I like this video or anything. But uh, yeah, so in the next video after this or before this, depending on how long it is, um, <clears throat> I will actually be doing another challenge on Gundir, where we'll be using the mail breaker, which is the worst starting weapon in the game. So see so yeah, how that goes. And other than that, let's jump straight into this. So I think I showed you how, uh, yeah, the Ethereal Borough Valley looks. It looks very beautiful. Uh, and the requirements actually, oh wait, I skipped the bonfire. The requirements actually get, here is you actually need to kill the Deacon to the Deep or you can't get through the fence with the small doll. Because you need a small doll to get through. It's actually pretty cool. Now there's actually like a big an like enemy enemy that spawns right behind you. Yeah, that we are not gonna fight that because that is it's super annoying to kill, and hits super difficult like hits so hard it's ridiculous. And he chases you too, which is another thing. So uh, the servers are actually currently off. Servers are actually currently off right now, so uh, no invasions and all that can happen pretty cool because I'm pretty happy because I get a lot of evasions in this area but uh, since the servers are off no evasions for us because I'm not the best at PvP so if I ever get invaded and you expect me to kill them don't because I'm not good at PvP whatsoever all right so we got that uh, I can definitely say on my first playthrough this area was super fucking annoying to get through because these guys just hit so fast and so strong it was so I, I wasn't adjusted to them yet. but now I'm completely used to them ooh I do not have enough stamina there you go I did hey you got the curved sword they use oh yeah f cunt Pulling up your shield like that. So uh, for tomorrow's second video, I actually have a long Overwatch video, which me and my friends made earlier today. Uh, it, it's weird. We just talk about random shit, have fun. It's really it. Nothing special. I guess just another funny moments video in a way. I don't really know. But uh, yeah, I want to do more Overwatch on my channel, so I was like, eh, might as well record this because we don't play Overwatch. That uh, we've been getting back into it. Just like how we've been getting a little bit back into Call of Duty. Yeah, these fire witches are annoying. Because they do one attack. Which, like, they slam the ground. Yeah, like that. They slam the ground and, like, this huge fire fucking puddle comes up. And it, and it just blasts you into the sky. It's, it's one of the worst attacks ever. There you go. That's how you dodge that one. So let's actually run. This oh, hey, that was a very kind. There you go, kill that. Uh, drink, and now we got these guys to wait for. There's a walk super slow towards us. Okay, so we need 16,000 souls when we can level up. Like I said, they walk slow. So, a weapon you can actually get from these guys is actually a really good weapon. It's the Claymore Sword. But you can get the Claymore Sword really early on, so... Are you kidding me? Yeah, I forgot. There's another Fire Witch up there. And he's, he's just as annoying. Oh yeah. 
Alright, let's go kill that fire witch. Luckily, he has no protectors, so we could just run up there and kill him. That chased me. So, for anybody wondering, this area actually home is home to one of the most hardest bosses in the game. In my opinion, probably the second hardest boss. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry if I do cough. My throat is just fucked right now. But uh, probably the second hardest boss to me in the game. Uh, I guess I guess I'll just tell you. His name is Pontiff Sullivan. Really, really awesome boss. Uh, as he was difficult and took me probably the probably killed me the most out of any boss in this game. I did learn a really good lesson about it because I heard about how hard he was, and I expected to just go in there and just be. Like, I'm I'm a, I'm a fucking breeze through this guy, and, and then I ended up getting my ass beat a lot. And when, when I say a lot, I, I mean a lot. Like that was just, that was, that was not fun. That was painful in all ways possible. Let's get the jump attack and the run attack. Oh. Nice. Don't do your little magic shit. Get dead. I like these guys because they actually drop a lot of souls. Go pick up this. Oh, I forgot there was a crystal lizard. There's no item, right? I remember there being an item. Somewhere around here, at least. I hear something screaming. I can tell you that much. Oh, yeah. Here's the item. <coughs> Once again, your boy's dying. Alright, so this is actually where I wanted to stop, and if you didn't know, uh, I think it's this. Oh wait, no, it's not here, huh. I think you actually need to do quest like, well, there's like, normally there's like a statue over there, and it's fucking, it's like a, it's a pilgrim. And if you kill him, you get the chameleon spell, which basically makes you blend in with your, uh, uh, environment, which is pretty cool. So yeah, this is useless. And uh, yeah, so this is actually where I wanted to stop. So now what we're going to do, we're going to run back to Filing Shrine, level up, and we're going to end the video. So obviously this is going to be a little bit more short than the usual. Next video should be a little bit more longer. And the video after that depends on how many tries that boss. For each video, I'm going to give a boss three tries. If a boss, ta uh, if I die three in those three tries, I'll make another video on that boss until we beat it and then if i make a full video on that like one boss i'll give it five tries because i don't want to i don't want to make a super long video of me just constantly dying to a difficult fucking boss like nobody wants to see me nobody wants to see that not even me that's that's just painful it's painful but uh yeah so we have twenty five thousand souls so well, let's go ahead and upgrade uh what should i upgrade guys I'll upgrade my health. Farewell, Ashen One. Let's see if I can upgrade my weapon. No, I need four more large Titanite scales. You know what? I'm actually going to buy those embers off of you. Thank you very much. Ashen One. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, anyway, uh, that is going to be the end of the video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, uh, comment. Uh, I actually want to shout out to a guy named Matt the Dude. I'm going to leave a link in the description to his channel. Make sure to check him out. Subscribe to him. He's a really cool dude. Uh, I really appreciate him giving me a shout out. Um, thanks, man, if you're watching this video. Really respect that. Appreciate it. Very nice of you. Um, so like I said, make sure to go subscribe to him, check him out, leave a like, comment, say I sent you. Don't really care what you do, just make sure to check him out, subscribe at least. Because this guy deserves way more subscribers than what he has and deserves much more support for being an awesome guy. But um yeah, uh I already said uh leave like, subscribe, all that bullshit. So anyway, putting all that away. Uh hope you guys enjoyed.
And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, my beautifuls.